Hi guys, in today's video, I'm gonna share with you how to change the Wi Fi network for the printer Canon MD2920. The reason why I have to change the Wi Fi setup is because I moved the house to another place and use another Wi Fi network. This one is not the new printer. We have used this one at the old house, and at this time, this printer connects to a Xfinity Wi Fi network. And when we move here, we use AT&T. So basically, the Wi-Fi is different. Now we have to reprogram or rejoin the network for this printer. This video gonna help in case that you change the Wi-Fi network. Let's say you move to another place and you want to reprogram the printer to join the new Wi-Fi network. And it also works with brand new printer because basically the process is the same. You need to set up the printer to join the Wi-Fi network. So that's all the device, including computer, mobile device that join to the same network with printer can print documentation wirelessly. You don't need to use the cable. And we're gonna do this setup by using Canon mobile app on the iPhone. In the next session, I'm gonna show my setup on mobile screen. Now we're gonna verify the setup on the printer first. To help the printer to join the Wi-Fi network, you need to make sure that the power button is on on the printer and also the Wi-Fi network is on. This light is on just because my color ink was out, but it's not a big deal. I'm gonna replace this later. And before you get started, I would suggest that you perform a reset on the Wi-Fi setting on the printer. You do this by press and hold the wireless button until you see a flashing on this slide. Just press and hold the Wi-Fi for a while. Okay, so you are good. You are seeing a flash on this slide. And then now the wireless light is flashing. And now we're going to jump into the setup on my mobile screen. So now what we're going to do is we we'll go to Apple Store and we're going to download a Canon printer mobile app and we're going to use that application to set up the Wi-Fi to connect the Wi-Fi to our home router. When we done that setup, we can print from any device that connect to the same network while listening. To get started, just open the App Store and go into Shirt on the right side, Shirt for Canon. Download Canon Print the second from the top, select Get and install it. Click Open. Tap to Agree for the extended survey. And tap to the Add Printer at the top left corner. And tap to Register Printer. The mobile device is going to search for Printer and it's going to say Printer could not be found. The reason because you are not signing the printer with the Wi-Fi network yet. So we're gonna do it by select perform wireless LAN setup. Then select auto select connection, the first option. The Canon printer come with a internal Wi-Fi router. In this step, you're gonna connect your iPhone to that internal router. You're gonna see a text like waiting for connection to the network starting with Canon IZ. So just go back to the setting on the iPhone and connect to this Wi-Fi network. This is internal Wi-Fi network broadcast from the printer. The reason why you need to connect to this internal network because you want to send all of the Wi-Fi setting from the mobile device to the printer with the username and the password and you're gonna send that setting to the printer so it's gonna be able to connect to the home router as well. So let's go back to the setting on the iPhone Select setting and under the Wi-Fi is seeing we are connecting to our home router right now but we're gonna change this setting to connect to internal Wi-Fi network on the printer and you can see on Wi-Fi starting with Canon underscore IZ underscore setup this one is internal Wi-Fi network that's broadcast from the printer and you can see there's no lock icon Next to the Wi-Fi, it means you can connect to this Wi-Fi without any password. So now the iPhone is connected to the internal Wi-Fi network. We're gonna go back to the Canon app to continue our setting. The application notifies that 
the iPhone is already connected to the printer and right now you're gonna continue the setup to connect the printer to the home router network and there's a question the printer will be connected to the following wireless router you see the mobile right here is the name of our home network so I'm gonna select yes and at this step you're gonna type in the password for the home Wi-Fi network and tap OK it may take a while for the printer to connect to the home network and the app notifies that the setting has been sent at this time you have completed the setup to connect the printer to the home network basically what you have done is you using the Canon mobile app on the iPhone and send the setting for the username and the password to connect to the home network to the printer to do that you need to access into the internal Wi-Fi network on the printer and then type in the username and the password and from there you send that username and password to the home router so that the printer later on can connect to the home router tap to OK and now the printer is available in the home network and you're gonna tap into this Canon MZ29 series printer and the printer is ready sure and ready to go tap OK now go back to the setting on the iPhone and you can see after finish the setting on the printer the iPhone is now connect to the home network automatically and the internal Wi-Fi network on printer is disappear from the list of Wi-Fi because it only show when you set up the network right now if you need to set up for the printer that internal Wi-Fi is no longer broadcast anymore so you are good now when the printer is on the network you can print any document from any device computer iphone ipad or android device that connect to the same network with the printer which is a home network thank you for the watching